Hey my little nerdies, it is Nerdy Nisi here and today as you can see we do have The Sims 4 up. We received a challenge from my lovely, lovely fiance to properly play this game. Um, I really love The Sims 4. I played The Sims, Sims 2, Sims 3. I really love The Sims. What I really love though is I really like creating Sims and I really like building houses and um, decorating houses. That's what I really love to do. I don't really like play the game of which like living out of Sims life and all that. I don't really do that. That's what this challenge is all about is to properly play this game. So my fiance gave me a list of rules that I have to follow and I'll explain it because it's simple, but I gotta make sure I follow them. So. Rule number one, most importantly, I have to get to 10 generations in a family. Uh, second rule, I have to move into an existing house. I cannot build a new house. Uh, I cannot move into an existing house, demolish it, and rebuild. I cannot do that. The uh, I can um, add to an existing house, for instance, if I have a one-story house. I can make a two-story house, so I can add. I, I just can't demolish the entire house. Um, I uh, After generation five, I can build a new house if I want to, but at that time, I'm like, I'm, I don't know if I'll be like, what's the point? I don't know. Um, uh, number three is I cannot use mother load. Um, he didn't want me using cheats at all. Um, but I asked if I could do the remove objects uh, cheat, and he originally was like, no, no cheating at all. Like, they're cheats for a reason. I was like, please. Uh, so he gave it, <laughs> and um, the one rule, or the no cheating is um, no funds, no changing of the money, anything like that. So, um, yeah, I can do the move objects, but I cannot use mother load. And then the last one, I just have to make sure I turn on aging to properly uh, have the sim, you know, eventually die, which I don't want to happen, but it happens. So let's go ahead, start with episode number one, where we have to create our first generation. Okay, guys, so I came upon a little bit of a dilemma already, and I haven't even really started. Do I want to have my first generation as me and Zach, my fiance, or do I want to do two random Sims? Um, cause I'm, I also, I like creating like based off real people, uh, but I am horrible at the facial structures and stuff, getting all that matching. Um, so I think what I'll do, because this is, his challenge, I think we should do, me and Zach. Um, I'll probably try to get as close as I can uh, and do all that inspiration. I'll just say it's based off inspiration of us. So we're gonna start off with me then because I uh, uh, got the female character first that popped up. So let's go ahead. I always like to start with the hair. I do have dark hair as you can see and it's a, uh, this long and so let's go ahead try to try to get it I don't know if I really like do it mm, I don't know I also probably should take a picture of myself because you always think you know what you look like and then you realize you're wrong so let's go ahead take picture and I'm gonna take a side picture too hopefully I can get this right okay okay so let's go ahead um, I'm gonna do like that kind of hairstyle first, just to get the hair out of the way. Uh, like I said, it's not gonna be good. Um, and get the makeup off. I don't wear makeup. <laughs> like right now, I am not wearing makeup. Uh, that kind of looks like my eyes a little bit. I don't know, guy. Okay. Oh yeah, I also have like. The under eye, like, uh, yeah, I have that. Um, uh, that kind of looks, I don't know. 
The eye color is spot on. That is my eye color. Um, no, my eyes are more like this. Um, uh, trying. Okay. Let's just go with that. And then eyebrows. I have really thin eyebrows. Uh, I mean, it's, I mean, it's kind of like that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, sure. I, like, I want to say that, but that looks kind of weird. <laughs> Maybe it's just like, I don't know. Cause my, it, it does go like this and that's just, maybe, maybe, maybe I have to go to e edit detail. No, that just looks even weirder. Okay. I mean, ha, ah, this is so hard. Eyebrows. Uh, you know what? We'll just do that. I have like really thin eyebrows. <laughs> ah, okay. Uh, lips. I got very, um, I don't know if they're big. Yeah, that's kind of me. Okay, nose, let's go to the side. So I I realize I have a slight little bump right here. I don't, like, I've never broken my nose that I know of. Um, but yeah, I have a slight little bump on my nose. I don't think I can portray that. And then my nose is a bit out. <laughs> critiquing your own face oh yeah that kind of looks like it yeah okay let's go with that um i don't have a like a what is this called like a, a, a mole i don't have that face let's go ahead um yeah what is oh you can change that oh okay yeah let's go with that uh <laughs> Faces. We already edited our face. We don't have. That. Oh dear! No! 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 Uh, what is this? No. I don't have freckles. Hair time. Uh, so I have long hair. Uh, well, not long, long, but it's pretty, pretty good. Uh, it's enough for me. <laughs> Okay, so we got to find a nice hairstyle. Um, I mean, this seems right. Like, I like it. It's about this, so like this size, this length. You know, I'm kind of digging it. I think, I think that might be the one. Because my hair, okay, you guys don't know, because I usually have my hair in a ponytail, braids, or just down. My hair will not curl, like... I even put like extra hold spray in it to keep the curl and my hair is just like no I'm done uh, it's got a mind of its own it's not even gonna it's, it's just like no it's it's got a life of its own so I'm just like now I'm just like you do you hair do you uh, I'm not even gonna gonna bother with you <laughs> uh, I don't have bangs I do sometimes wear my hair like that but I don't want to for this game uh kind of and i don't think i've ever used this type of hair before so maybe 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 no 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 i don't know i don't i think we'll have to go with that one i don't know okay anyway everyday look i don't wear hats uh let's go ahead and change out of all this Oh, I don't have tattoos. Wait, how do you change? I, I, oh. Okay, there we go. Okay. So my everyday look, I wear, um, so I wear t uh, jeans uh, because I get very cold. I wear uh, usually a graphic tee. And like in this room, it's fine because I have all these electronics and it's heating up the room very, very, very well. Um, but normally I have to wear some kind of sweater or cardigan. I feel like an old lady when I find like a really cute cardigan, 
but uh, I get really, really cold. Um, so we're going to go ahead, put little jeans on. Um, I normally wear sneakers or, well, right now I'm wearing boots. Um, but to go with those, wear some socks. Um, I wear white socks. Zach wears black. Otherwise, we, we lose socks. Like, he wears mine. I, yeah. Um, so, what did, what did I say? He wears black, I wear white. Um, shoes, let's find a cute little pair of boots, wedges. Right now I'm wearing, um, there's these boots, but they're, they're wedge boots. Because I am short and I want to feel a little bit taller than what I am. Uh, so, they're kind of like these, but these are more wintry. But it's fine. It's covered up by the jeans. It's fine. Plus, I get cold. That kind of works. Um, and then, like I said, I wear graphic tee. Uh, but right now, there is a sweater. Um, I don't have it in my, this room because I took it off in the living room. Uh, but I have this cute little uh, sweater. It has a, a hood, and I just absolutely love it. It is a bit chilly out, uh, so I do wear it when I go outside. And where is it? Because it's so adorable. It's like this. But it has a hood. And I love it. So I'm going to go ahead with this as my everyday look. I know I'm like... I like to be covered up. Because I get cold. And I don't want to freeze. Even in the summer. Sometimes I wear a hoodie. Because I'm like cold. I don't know if it's like poor blood circulation or what. Uh, but yeah. Okay, so, uh, full body. Uh, this is our formal look. And, uh, for a formal look, I would wear a dress. Uh, now, it's been a while since I've been to a wedding or any kind of formal event. Um, but I am engaged. Uh, I don't know if we'll have a wedding. We talk about it, especially with COVID. People ask me, like, when's your wedding? I'm like, ah, for COVID. Uh, so... Let's go ahead, like, choose, like, a wedding style. Um, I, or, or, oh, that's really cute. I like that. But, yeah. Um, like, this is really cute, but I don't know, guys. I don't know. Like, let's be honest. This is probably the thing I'll be wearing. <laughs> uh, but I do like this. I like designs and stuff like that. I don't know if I would feel comfortable. I'm also not very comfortable in my own skin. I'll be honest. I'm working on my myself and stuff like that in that regards. I'm going to put on some white shoes. Um, Okay, I'm going to change this to white, just to get the white wedding dress. Maybe not. Maybe. I like some, like, I've seen some wedding dresses that are, like, ombre, which I really adore. So it doesn't really have to necessarily be white, I guess. This one's really cute. I'm kind of going back to this, and I don't know if it's because of the, that, which reminds me of, like, Bride of Frankenstein or Mummy, something like that. But I'm loving it. Um, plus you can see those shoes. And that's probably also something I'd be able to walk in, let's be honest. I can't walk in heels. <laughs> that's why my boots are wedged. Uh, and then we definitely need to, uh, change up our hairstyle for, uh, having an updo. Now, I will be honest, I can't do my hair to save my life. That's why it's either in a ponytail, braid, or down. Um, maybe that's why I won't curl. <laughs> so, um, I would want like an, if it's a wedding, I would do like a, like a, not just, not that, but something a bit more formal. <laughs> uh, like this is really cute. Um. I would do maybe like that but I I really do love this and it's I can't do that 
but I, I'm, I'm kind of liking that. I don't know if that's in, like not formal enough, but I do like it. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's pretty too. That's pretty. Oh, it has a thing. Yeah, let's go with that. Let's go with that. Um, put some necklace on. Uh, what kind of necklace do we like? I like this one. That's cute. Um, I don't have earrings, um, uh, but maybe you could do some clip-ons. I don't know. Oh, that's too big. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. You know what? Let's not do earrings because that's just going to be a hot mess. Uh, and then what was the other thing? Makeup. Makeup. Okay. Makeup. I would do something I because I can't do my own makeup to save my life. Uh, something a little bit basic, not too bold. Um, but again, I'm horrible at makeup. That's just me. Uh, like, I don't even know if it looks good. Like, I'm, I'm really bad at makeup, guys. It's, it's just me. This is just me. I will tell you, if I could do my own makeup, I would be so happy. <laughs> But I can't. Like, I think this would look good. And that's too dark. I even know it. But I'm still like, it looks fine. Uh, we'll just do that. Cheeks. Put some of the blush. And I would do... Uh, actually, I don't know what I would do. Let's be honest. Because I I don't know. Um, maybe, like, maybe like a pink? A pink rose? No, that's... That, no. There we go. Let's just go with that. It's fine. Uh, okay. Anyways. If anybody has any tips on makeup, let me know. Because I, I can't do it. Uh, athletic wear. Okay, so I wear, uh, like, that. <laughs> um, with some sneakers, which I like those. Those are nice. And a t-shirt or a tank top. Um, I don't feel comfortable enough to wear this yet because my stomach, I need to work on it. I actually bought a ring fit, uh, to help me like work out. So hopefully that'll motivate me. Um, but I, you know what? Let's be honest. I probably most likely would wear the, the hoodie <laughs> because like I would get hot yeah, let's let's be honest. We're we're going with that, <laughs> and change up the hair because I would want my hair out of my face. Uh, how do you, where's the hair? Okay, and um, I, I like that hairstyle. I really do. Wait, ooh, that's cute too. But yeah, I like that other one better. Um, I mean. You know what? That's probably what I would do. Is just clip it up. I don't have any clips, but that's probably what I would do. <laughs> um, it's just something. I'm looking if there's anything else. Uh, yeah, we'll go with that. That one that I found. That one the, from Laundry Day. I remember that's Laundry Day. Ooh, or this one. Yeah, we'll go with that one. That one works. Because I probably, let's be honest, I'll put a band, like a headband over. Okay, sleep. This is easy. Although that's really adorable. Um, so first I'm going to put slippers. Both me and Zach, we both got slippers recently. Um, and we love it. We love it. Um, but the bad thing is Parker also loves our slippers and he likes to just take off with them. Uh, so that's not good. Um, uh, but let's go ahead, choose that. And then I just like to wear a t-shirt because I get too hot or too cold. I'm never comfortable. Parker and, um, when we go to bed, he'll go under my blanket and lay down like in my arm. And then he like, we're both like posters. So, um, eventually we both get hot. 
he gets out from underneath the blanket eventually and goes to the end of the bed. And so then I get cold. Um, it's kind of, it's a nightly ritual. He gets upset if he can't get underneath the blanket. It's hilarious. Okay, party look. Let's see. Uh, let's be honest. I probably would wear jeans. Um, but I'm going to try not to. Um, I mean, that's cute. I like that. I don't know if I would wear that, though. Let's see. What do we got for boots? Uh, because I do love a good boot. Ooh, that's kind of like something I have. You know what? I kind of want to go with that. I don't know if that's what I would wear, though. Ah, uh, choices. <gasps> that's really cute. Okay, Sims. Um, I always wanted more clothes like this. With, it's like the shirt is, goes to the feet. Make more. Or not the shirt, but you know what I mean. Like a coat. Uh, I would not wear that because I don't have anything like that. Um, should we go with that sweater dress? I feel like I should go with sweater dress. Uh, I kind of like that though. Uh, yeah, I would go with this one, but I would not wear the sparkly t-shirt. Um, but I, I, I like that. I have a, a, a well, it's a, more like a cardigan. Um, but something like that. So, yeah, we'll go with that. Uh, swim. Uh, I am still too insecure to wear a two-piece. So, let's go ahead and <laughs> change to that. There we go. All done. And hot weather. Okay, hot weather. Okay. Um, I wear, I have a couple long skirts. And there is this one that I'm so excited to wear and i love it it's it's so cute um and it's it's kind of like this no 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 no. this one yeah 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 kind of maybe a little different color but i still love it and i cannot wait to wear it if i can find it <laughs> we've been like going through some of our clothes to see like what we can get rid of and hopefully this did not go in the box on the, in the box box for donations uh, okay so um but i do i would wear like um uh i do have a couple of t-shirts i do have uh well you know what well i'll probably wear a graphic tee let's be honest i love my graphic tees um but i do have a couple tank tops that i would wear a bit not that but i don't think that looks too good with it Oh, I would love to wear something like this. Okay. Um, gotta work out. Rain fit. And. Ooh. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, let's see what we got. Any good. Yeah, I like this because it's like, it's like a graphic tee. And that's totally what I would wear with this. Yeah. We'll do that. Okay, and then lastly, hot weather, or hot weather, cold weather. Cold weather, I wear my jeans because uh, I'm not wearing my skirt outside. It's too cold for that. Uh, so we're going to do a fair blue jeans sometimes. You know what? Let's go with that. Um, shoes, I would wear winter boots. Um, not like those, though. I don't think I own something like that. Uh, maybe I do. Maybe it is that. I don't know. I don't know, guys. Let's just go with that. And then top, um, I do, well, I have my jacket, my winter jacket still here. It's, it's thick. So that's what I would wear. And it's black. I like, I like a black, uh, winter jacket. And yeah, here's mine. That's my winter jacket. It's still behind me because, um. Parker does like sometimes laying behind my back of my chair and um, he has to have something comfortable and all that. So that's what I have. So I think that's it for the clothes. I'm not going to change much. So let's go through. We got our everyday look. 
we have our formal look, which I absolutely love this, this look. I love the hair. Um, we got our workout look. We have our sleeping look and our party look, which it's been a while. I don't think, I don't know, birthday party. It's got birthday balloons. So yeah, I probably would wear something like that. Our swim look our um hot weather look and our cold weather look so let's go ahead um this is based off me um which is hard i know for zach i would choose the the um where the food uh master chef but for me it's pretty difficult like i know they don't have my real job in a sense um which is fine uh because like i said i try to keep our private like our private life as private as can be like my job I don't talk about and stuff like that just to kind of like some things to keep to myself um but uh it's kind of hard because like creativity uh I do I used to play an instrument um I do like music I like hearing music and I, I am trying to learn how to knit I do like making stuff I like right now I'm starting to make soap and um, I already used a bar that I already made uh, FYI don't leave it in the uh, water um, but uh, yeah I started making like homemade soap um, uh, and uh, but I also like I'm trying to like be more eco-friendly so I don't know if I want to do Eco Innovator or Lady of the Knits. Uh, it's so difficult, but we'll think about it for a minute. So uh, I don't know what to choose as my last name because my last our last names weren't married yet. Um, like I'm trying to keep that private as well. So let's see if there's any last names that I like. Um, uh, Riggs, Becker, Kane, Puckett, Ventura. Ventura, like Ace? <laughs> Let's go with that. Ace Ventura. Um, Zach wanted that pop in it. Yeah. Okay, so we're going with Ace Ventura. Gonna change my walk. I always like the feminine walk. It's so cute. It's like proper. I do not walk like that, but I like choosing it. Okay, uh, I'm gonna tr select our traits while I'm thinking still. It's hard, cause like Zach, I know what he's gonna have. Um, well, de I'm definitely a geek. Um, I mean, I'm kind of a child of the ocean because I really do like the ocean. I'm a bit scared of it now. <laughs> I'm like, is there gonna be a shark? Um, I, I would say, uh, I don't know if green theme would be good. I mean, I do, yeah, we'll choose that. Oh, and I am, I think I am creative. Cause like I said, I'm, I make, I'm trying to make soap. Uh, I do want to make some bath bombs cause I accidentally bought the wrong goat's milk and I'm hoping I could use it for bath bombs um but yeah I think that's what we'll choose uh, you know what I can always change it and I'm going to try to do the um eco innovator I think that's what we'll do so yeah wish me luck okay so we got me now we need to do a uh, create Zach. So, oh, I almost, whoops. Okay, so I'm gonna also put a picture of Zach up here so you guys can see uh, what he looks like, just briefly, um, I think, I don't know. Um, so I'm also, I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna choose this stuff right away. Uh, so he definitely, I would choose the food aspiration, the master chef. Um, I, I, I think he's a goofball. I love that about him. He's just, he's funny. 
Um, he's definitely a geek like me. We love to play video games together. Um, and I think I would choose foodie. Because we love to have good food. Um, and plus, he knows food. <laughs> he's always teaching me about it. And he's kicking me out of the kitchen. <laughs> so, uh, let's see. I need a picture. Um, and I get okay. I guess it's gonna be because I'm not, I don't have like the front and side profile that I did of him. So this is gonna be a little bit different, and this is gonna be more the inspiration. He's gonna be like, "Why are you taking a, a picture of me?" Um. Yeah, I guess. And he's got a little bit bushier eyebrows than I do. Mine are really thin. Um. He just looks angry. Angry. Uh, I feel really bad because I feel like I'm not going to do Zach justice on this. <laughs> uh, yes! Yes! I would say it's kind of like this. It's shaved on the side. And he can put in the ponytail like that. But he doesn't put it like this. But th that, that's good enough. I don't think we'll find anything better. Um, he does have a beard. Uh, like a stubble. So we'll keep that. Okay. Now for our outfits. Yay. And I should know. <laughs> I should know his outfit, shouldn't I? Okay, so I know uh, he wears jeans. And I know that because I wear some of his jeans. <laughs> it's really sad sometimes. Uh, so jeans. Um, and it's not like that. He wears... I guess. I don't know. What's that one store in the mall? That's where he, he has to get his jeans from there. It's really funny. Um, then he generally, gen, 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 generally <laughs> uh, wears sneakers. I said genuinely. I was like, that's not right. Um, I mean, do they have like yeah, that works. And he, no, he would not wear that. Uh, he's uh, been wearing this hoodie. Uh, it's a bit chilly out still. It's it's March. So he has been wearing this hoodie and it looks... Is it the zip up? It's kind of like this. Yeah, we'll go with that. That works. That works. Okay. Next. Oh, he is, he is a bit strong. And he's very skinny. <laughs> I forgot about that. Oh no, did I forget my character? What did, what did I look like? Oh, I'm not strong. <laughs> and, okay. That works. Okay. Me. Uh, oh no, 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 no. Zach does not wear glasses. He needs to go get glasses. Okay. Um. What is this? Formal? Okay. I have never been with him to like a wedding anything like that so I'm gonna choose what I like which I like a tux for him I think he would look really good and you know what this is my game so he can just deal with it he's wearing a tux <laughs> okay uh, no he would not wear that <laughs> so uh, working out um, I know exactly what he would wear because it's ridiculous like these shorts he has so many of these shorts and he would wear a tank top I don't know what kind of tank top but let's just go with that it works it's fine it's fine and what is that no uh, sure I don't like that though mm, yeah sure that works Okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm doing it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you can hate me for that one. Party. Um, let's see. What would he wear? He would just wear jeans and a shirt, I think. Like, he doesn't care. No, he, he would not wear that. Um, I think, yeah. I think we'll just go with jeans. And a shirt. <laughs> That's what he would wear. Uh, 
Actually, no, he's worn, like this. Yeah, yeah, he's worn something like that. Like that, yep. That's what I'll go with. And, uh, no. <laughs> no. Oh, this has accessories, I didn't even realize. <gasps> no. Oh, and that reminds me, I need to go back to mine. Um, and I need to put my engagement ring on. Ring. Okay, I'm gonna put it on a little. Yeah, oh, you can't put anything up, no. Fine, fine. You can wear your, no, I, okay, you know what? Swimming, I would not wear my ring. I would lose it so fast. Okay, there we go. Okay, there we go. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, my finger. Okay, party. Okay. Um, I, you know what? I've never been swimming with him. Uh, so this is just going to be my choice as well. Uh, we were going to take a trip um, and uh, where they have like it's a place where it has the ocean and um, Panama, actually. We were going to take a trip there and then COVID happened. So that didn't happen. Uh, gosh, no. Okay, what is this again? This is hot weather. Hot weather? I know exactly what he would wear. The same stuff he would wear for his gym outfit. <laughs> his shorts. And, and, well, something different. It'll probably be just a graphic tee. Um, let's just do that. Yeah, that works. And then some shoes. Okay, and then cold weather. The, I, the man's crazy, but um, he's got a little bit better. He used to wear, like, these shorts in the middle of winter. It's, like, snowing, and he would wear it. But he's gotten better now, and I swear he has this exact, like, coat. So we're going to go with that. So that's little Zach. Little Zach. Why am I saying that? That's Zach. Essentially, um, like I said, it's inspiration because I cannot do faces. So we got me. We got Zach. And you know what? We need one little addition to our little family. And that is is a little Parker. If I can type, can I type? Will this, okay. There we go. Little Parker. Okay. And okay. So for uh, the traits, he's definitely playful. He loves to play. Um, he's definitely loyal. Like, he's with me right now. You can't see him, but he's definitely, he's right there. Like, it's so funny. In the morning, so I'm working from home right now, and in the mornings, I, I get up, because I work very early, and I go to the kitchen area, the kitchen living room, uh, that has my work area, and I start my, my day. Parker has the option to stay in bed with Zach, and he doesn't absolutely doesn't he has to get up with me even though he could be dead tired and doesn't want to get up he still gets up and goes with me and i'm like you can stay there but he's definitely loyal um so we're gonna go with that and then he's out he hit well, a little bit um no 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 he does not do that he's not very aggressive he does bark um, and he does sound aggressive, um, but he, he's not. He just gets, like, if, if we're holding him back from another dog, because we don't want, you know, we don't know that dog, um, he gets upset with us. <laughs> and then he sounds really aggressive because he's upset because he wants to go see that dog. So he does sound very aggressive, but he's not. He's very friendly, so I'm going to choose that. It's just really funny because he sounds, he's like, ah! <laughs> Okay, so, um, Parker's tail does not look like that. It's more like that, and it's so cute and adorable. Um, and I, I do like to put him in some clothes sometimes, especially when he's, he's shaved, um, and he gets a bit too cold. Like, I 
I feel bad because he's always like, you know, curled up, especially after like a bath and stuff. So I try to put him in um, a, a shirt. Zach doesn't like me doing that, so I don't do it often. Um, but let's go ahead and put him in a little shirt. He looks so adorable. He's adorable. Okay, let's see. Okay, so, oh, so we got a relationship husband. And making sure I've got all the... I like the swagger walk. I like it. And then a little Parker. Now, I'm not going to change like Parker's fur and all that. It's fine. It's fine. He does look like that when he's got like full hair. Um, it, it's, it's adorable. Um, so yeah, we're going to go with that. And our little family is complete for generation one. Okay guys. So that's it for episode number one of this play this properly challenge that I got from my fiance. We have our family creative. We have little Parker, we have me and we have Zach. So next episode, I am going to choose spring and we are going to have to move into an existing house. So if you guys want to join along in this uh, with me, go ahead, hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. If you like this video and want to see me succeed and proving Zach wrong that I can play this game properly, hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below what your thoughts are. And you can also follow me on my social media. Both my Twitter and my Instagram is at NerdyNeasy. I am also streaming on Twitch as well, twitch.tv forward slash NerdyNeasy as well. Um, and I do have a Discord. All links will be in the description below. As always, guys, keep on staying nerdy, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!